Welcome back to Dynamic Steward Daily Video. Why do you return your tithe and give your offerings? Nehemiah 10 reports about three reasons that led the people of Israel to return tithe and give offerings. Firstly, they gave as part of the covenant that existed between themselves and God. The chapter begins with the list of leaders and the people who entered into a covenant with God. And returning tithe and offerings was part of this agreement. Secondly, they gave because there was a need at the temple. We read in verses 32, 33, we assume the responsibility for carrying out the commands to give a third of a shekels each year for the service of the house of our God, for the bread set out on the table, for the regular grain offerings and burnt offerings, and for the offerings of the Sabbath at the new moon feasts and at the appointed festivals. Thirdly, they gave simply because God was blessing them. We read in verse 37, Moreover, we will bring to the storerooms of the house of our God, to the priests, the first of our ground meal, of our ground offerings, of the fruit of all our trees and of our new wine and olive oil and we will bring a tithe of our crops to the levites for it is the levites who collect the tithes in all the towns where we work they have enjoyed a good harvest god has prospered them and they gave offerings and returned tithe in response to what God has provided, not only to attend to perceived needs. Dear friends, I am in a covenant with God. I realize that much resources are necessary for God's mission to move forward and am enjoying His blessings. Therefore, I have good reasons to return tithe and give offerings. What about you? Read the Bible daily and be a partner with God.